Initiating system one. System one loaded. Uh, my name is Abonifa bin Abuasa and my metric number is 2019-805252. My name is Kamen Embasmi. To the ID 2019-253612. My name is Nurasima binti Halim. My student number is 2019-219666. My name is Nofitria binti Zupaidi. My student number is uh, 2019-805256. So for the introduction of our assignment is First of all, we know Nava is a university student of UATM She want to buy a new computer to do his assignment Beside that, she will use a utility programming software Such as VBNet, the Photoshop, uh, Microsoft Word, Excel, PowerPoint and so on So she also need to do a rendering and gaming. So for the rendering and gaming, we also know we need a powerful PC and a large storage of the PC. So we have made a discussion with the team to research, make research and provide the number the best component with a reasonable price of the component to build a powerful PC for the number. <laughs> What is motherboard? Motherboard or M-board is an integrated circuit uh, that house of CPU that allow all the device to communicate with it. Okay, firstly, our group choose ASRock A320MHDV brand for this motherboard. This motherboard has unique feature which is ASRock Super Alloy that is a high density glass fabric uh, PCV and also Sapphire Black PCB. For the CPU, it supports AMD socket AM4, A-series APU, Bristol Ridge, and Ryzen series CPU, uh, that is Submit Ridge and Raven Ridge. Then, for the memory, it supports the DR4, uh, 3200 plus OC, Ryzen CPU, and also 2400 A-series APU. For the slot, this motherboard support one PCIe 3.0 multiply 16 and also one PCIe 2.0 multiply 1. For the graphic, it has a uh, HDMI, DVI-D and also this sub. For the audio, it supports uh, 7.1 CHHD audio Realtek ALC at X7 audio codec and also Elna audio caps. For the storage, it support uh, 4 SATA 3 and 1 Ultra M.2 which is PCIe Gen 3, Multiply 4 and SATA 3. For the real panel, it has CUSB 3.1 Gen 1 uh, which is 2 front and 4 rear. And lastly, for the OS, it support Microsoft Windows 10 uh, 64 GB and Realtek Gigabit LAN. And the price uh, of this motherboard are only around 220 ringgit. So, computer case that I will choose is from the master cooler. It's named uh, Masterbox Litfa ARGB. So, this uh, Masterbox ARGB is come standard with the three three component that uh, uh, include the uh, RGB light, fan, and the interior that can fit all the motherboard and the gaming stuff so the color comes in three colors so Nava can choose the color that she want so the color is red black and blue so this is kind 
of computer case suitable for the all all generation motherboard in the market so the price of the computer case is RM 239 ringgit only so this is a best price that we can consider to the naval okay for this assignment the hardware that we suggest to naval for APC we choose processor AMD Ryzen 5 3600 for the processor it was a product of Ryzen which is a generation 5 processor come from this plan this processor has a base frequency 3.6 GHz and it makes terrible frequency is 4.2 GHz it was suitable for now one who want a PC that can be used to make a simple programming this processor also come with a rust th thermal solution that can handle the temperature up to 55, 55 Celsius. We can get it with price 777 ringgit. For system memory, I choose a data SPG spec street D41 RGB 8GB DDR4. The system memory has a speed of DDR4 which is 2666 MHz and up to 3000 200 megahertz it also, it also has a 8 gigabyte SS module size that really compatible for any DDR4 technology for your operating temperature it can go up to 85 Celsius and for the storage temperature you will go between 55 Celsius to 100 Celsius for the system and memory we can get it with the price of RM 184 next for graphic card, we choose NVIDIA GeForce GTX 1030 Ti. It is a product of NVIDIA that uses bus standard PCI Express T3.0 and has 2GB video memory GDDR5. Its GPU base clock is 1072MHz and for its GPU boost clock is 1150MHz. As it uses the GDDR5, its memory clock is 5400 MHz. This graphic card price is RM260. As for hard disk, we choose Western Digital 2TB SATA hard disk blue. It has a 2TB capacity and SATA 6GB per second interface. For its speed, it has 5400 RPM class. And for this hard disk, we can get it on RM245 ringgit. Lastly, for DVD ROM, we choose Asus DRW24D5MT internal DVD or CD writer SATA. This DVD ROM has 24 times DVD writing speed with e-green technology that saves over 15% of power cons consumption. It also provides double the security with this encryption too, through password control and hidden file name function. For this, the price that we can get is RM55. Uh, so for the software, uh, I I will recommend the Nava to use a uh, Adobe Photoshop 2020 Master Collection because this is uh, one of the software of editing that all in one suit to the umbrella of Adobe. Uh, user can fantastically use this software that contain a lot of the software edit that popular such as at the Photoshop, at the Premiere, at the Illustrator, and so on. So, the user can choose whatever uh, software that she want to install in the laptop or PC. So, this is a powerful editing software ever. So, I will recommend it to the Naval to use this software of editing. So the price is not too high, not too low. The price is RM 33 cents. 
uh, net software is a uh, of course when we want to install the software we need a window so I will recommend the Nava to install the window 10 OEM pad so this pad is uh, so reasonable and this pad is a window 10 pro so it will give you given Nava a full license and only one PC can use it so this is good for the Nava the price is around 45 ringgit and 40 cent uh, for the window 10 so the benefit is Nava can install easily with the reasonable price I will proceed for my part which cover the input devices and the output devices in the input devices it was divided two items which is keyboard and mouse as what we know, keyboard is the set of keys on a computer that we need to press in order to make it work. The specification is first the brand. The brand is G700. Second, USB version which is USB 2.0. Third, material type is ABS. Fourth, keyboard type is 104 QWERTY keyboard. And the keyboard size is, it has length about 470 mm, 180 mm for width and 25 mm for height and the price is 39 ringgit and 80 cent. Next, I will explain more about the input device which is mouse. Mouse is a pointing device that fits under the palm of our hand comfortably. This mouse is a wireless optical mouse type. It can be used up to 10 meters from the computer and the interface is a USB. For the colors, it has various options such as black, white, gold, silver, and rose gold. The DPI is 800-1200-1600 and uses a built-in rechargeable battery 500 mAh as a power supply. It has four main buttons and suitable for desktop and laptop users. The price is only 14 ringgit and 19 cents. Then, let's move to output devices. It has divided into a few parts such as printer, speaker, headphone, earbud, and joystick. First, printer. Printer is a produce text and graphics on a physical medium. For this printer, it has a function to print, scan and copy the material. It prints speed ISO PPM black is 7.5 and color is 5.5. The warranty for this printer is barely until 3 years. It can make up for monthly duty cycle up to 1000 pages. The supported ink is HP 680 ink black and 3 color. The types of paper that can be used is A4, B5, A6, and DL envelope. And the price is 239 ringgit. The deck speaker. Speaker is defined as an electrical device used to make sound or music louder. For this speaker, it was a portable 2.0 USB stereo with the output is 3 volt time 2. Its maximum power is 6 volt and it has 58 decibel. The imp impedance is 4 ohm and for frequency, it responds at 20 Hz to 20 kHz. Then, the weight is 0 0.52 kg and the price is 30 ringgit and 99 cents. Afterward is headphone. Headphones are speakers that cover or place outside of the ear. This headphone is a wireless with a headband style. It uses a UX as a connector with the length of 3.5mm. The main function is dynamic which is noise cancelling and microphone use. For microphone, it has 3.5mm with sensitivity 9 ohm. For frequency, it responds at range of 20 until 16,000 Hz. The support APP is 1.4 meter and has two color of it, which is red and blue. The price is 15 ringgit and 80 cents. Then, earbud. 
Earbud also called earphones, which rest inside the ear canal. This earbud come with key features such as 3D surround sound, clear sound, and a great microphone to interact with other. For the speaker, the impedance is 16 ohm plus minus 15 percent, with diameter 10 millimeter. Then the sensitivity for this earbud is around 69 decibel plus minus 3 decibel. The rate output power is 3 milliwatt and for maximum output power is 5 milliwatt. Its frequency response range is 20 kHz. For the mic, the direction is omnidirectional with diameter 4 mm times 1.5 mm. The sensitivity is 40 plus minus 3 decibel and the operating voltage is less than 10 volt. Then the working current is around 0 0.15 until 0 0.5 milliamp. It is frequency response range is around 100 until 12 kilohertz and the signal to noise ratio is bigger than 55 decibel. The price for this earbud is 29 ringgit and 19 cents. Last for the output device is joystick. Joystick is a pointing device used to move an object on screen in any direction. This joystick is a PS2 wired game gamepad controller. Its interface is PS2 and the color is black. It is a wired type connection. The product size is approximately is 16 cm times 10 cm times 5.5 cm and the model is suitable for PS2 or PS1. The material type for the joystick is ABS and can be applied to for PS2 or PS1. The price is only 19 cents. As a conclusion, Computers are very important uh, to everyone, especially for new students. It is because computers are the one of students needed uh, to make their tasks and assignment. Uh, we can conclude uh, that all the components that we got in this assignment are very suitable for now. What assignment are show that all the components are below than three thousand ringgit. So. Uh, with this price, uh, all the student can buy and can buy and use it for their own use. So this is suitable for now what for their, their study by using all the component uh, such as uh, motherboard, computer case, hardware, software, input device, and also output device. Now what can use all the benefits of the components that we show in this assignment one by one. Uh, by seeing the specification uh, so now one will be easy to make her task and assignment smoothly without having a lagging uh, and crashing uh, now we'll also can use this uh, computer for gaming rendering so that's it thank you